My BFI player choice this week is a 70s classic from horror maestro Dario Argento, which has recently been revisited by art house darling Luca Guadagnino. But nothing can compare to the savage beauty of Argento's head spinning original Suspiria. <laughs> Made in the wake of the international success of Profondo Rosso and laying the groundwork for such later gems as Tenebrae, Opera and the underrated Stondal syndrome, Suspiria is a brilliantly choreographed descent into madness. Cult favourite Jessica Harper, who featured in Phantom of the Paradise and would go on to star in Shock Treatment, is the American ballerina who enrols in an exclusive European dance academy and discovers occult secrets hidden within the faculty enclave. Having earned writing credits on films like Sergio Leone's Once Upon a Time in the West, Argento made his name as a director with giallo thrillers like Bird with the Crystal Plumage and Four Flies on Grey Velvet. But he found his natural home in horror, where his bold visual and narrative experiments drew upon the genre-crossing legacies of Alfred Hitchcock and Mario Bava to create something wholly original and utterly unforgettable. <laughs> Despite a rational assurance that bad luck isn't brought by broken mirrors but by broken minds, Suspiria plunges the viewer into a kaleidoscopic maelstrom of shattered minds and bodies, all viewed through the glittering shards of the director's own fractured imagination. An evocative goblin score heightens the tension, its witchy shrieks and synthy strains clearly inspiring the work of Halloween director and composer John Carpenter. Censors balked at the film's more graphic elements on first release, with the BBFC demanding over a minute of cuts back in 1977. The version you're about to see now is the uncut original, bloodied but unbowed and still unequaled. Mm -hmm. 